This experiment is mentioned in the second last paragraph of this passage where um, they basically tell us about his experiment and about how uh, he chose 100 undergraduate students and basically asked, uh, gave them names of birds and fish in a um, language that they didn't understand obviously. But somehow they, the people were still able to intuit the names of birdiness or fishiness. By which they mean that um, there was something even in a language unknown that gave people clues as to whether it was a bird or a fish. Thus we can say that languages share recognizable and somewhat similar characteristics to the names of organisms. Hence we choose option B.